I have been getting so excited for fall. It is coming up so quickly. So I decided let's do a recreating Pinterest outfits with me video because one, I really enjoy them. Two, I like get some inspo from them. And three, I realized like how many clothes I have in my closet already that I don't need to go shopping for all the what you need this fall like type of vibes. So we're gonna go through, I have pulled together six different outfits and we'll try them on and then I'll rate like how well I did. You know what I mean? So it's like a fun little game and I hope you guys enjoy it. If you're new to my channel, my name is Mallory. I live in New York City, I work in fashion. I also do YouTube on the side as like a fun hobby, like creative outlet vibe. So if you're into thrifting, shopping, <laughs> vlogs, recreating producers outfits, anything like that, uh, make sure you subscribe to my channel. I post every week and yeah, we have lots of fun here. So let's get started. This is everything. I pulled everything out. It's all very um, neutral, which is new. And I will say like I'm doing this recreate thing, but I'm going to do my typical like 25 fall outfit ideas um, video. I just need to pull it together and like get a little more inspo on that. So that will be coming as well as the Laguna vlog, but I wanted to put this in here because I've just been feeling so inspired by fall. So, let's get started. Alright, so these are kind of spring to fall transitions because I wanted to pick out stuff that I could wear honestly like now. So the first one is this girl, she has a trench coat, she has her coastal grandma vibe sweater thrown over the shoulders, she's wearing white pants and some easy shoes. I could totally wear this into the office. Or honestly, just like on a Saturday farmer's market vibe or something. So let's start off with that one. So I do have white jeans, obviously, but I wanted to wear these new J. Crew pants that I got. They are just so cute. They're like a twill. I'll throw them on. Look at the little elastic waistband, little back pocket. They're just really, really cute and so good for work. So I wanted to wear them in this video. Set full body outfit. Boom, boom, boom. Now for the top. In the picture, I believe she's wearing just like a big chunky sweater. So I have this one or I have this one. And I kind of feel like I should do this one because her sleeve shows through. But because I'm going to do the fall transitional vibe, I think I'm going to just do this one so that it's a little more cool, you know? This top is Express. I thrifted it. It's so adorable. Okay. And then for shoes, I believe she has some kind of like golden gooses on or something. I have these kind of knockoffs from Target last year, which honestly, they don't fit great and they kind of fall off when I'm wearing them. But for this video, like, I just keep everything around because you never know when you're going to need them in videos. But they have the same vibe, so maybe I should keep them. They do look awfully adorable with these shoes. Um, and then I have this trench coat, which I love and adore. It's an INC trench coat from now, I probably like two years ago. So boom, and then she throws on her... Coastal Gran moment. I wish I had a striped sweatshirt that wasn't so large of stripes, but it kind of goes with the twill, huh? I don't know, y'all. This definitely is giving like, oh, she's playing dress up vibes. <laughs> but we'll tie it in the back. I always tie my trench coat like this to give myself a little shape while I wear it. Do we look dorky? Let's see. <laughs> it's like too busy, huh? Okay, I have another trench coat. Maybe, let me try that on. All right, this is a little more like appetizing. Boom. Okay. Oh, and then she has her, you know, work bag. If I saw myself wearing this, like walking down the street, I would think I was like a really rich housewife with my life fully together and not always falling apart every freaking day, huh? Okay. <laughs> anyway, so here's the fit. Final outfit. Boom. This is a Nordstrom rack uh, girly. And Louie, obviously. And yeah, I think I would give this one a 7 out of 10. That's 6. It's not that great, huh? <laughs> we started off like, you know, hopeful. Alright, so the next one is honestly like kind of cheating because I totally knew exactly that I had both of these things. So it's going to be 10 out of 10. So let's just change. Ready? Boom. Okay. And then boom, sweater. I got this. I want to say at a sample sale, but I can't remember. And I usually remember everything, so I really don't know where I got it. But it's French Connection, super cute, right? This skirt sample sale, it's Vince. It does fit a little bit big, but I just kind of let it happen. This also is maybe a little bit big, which makes me think it is a sample sale because samples are usually mediums. Okay, I just think the tuck 
makes it look nicer um, and more fitting. And then, let me just hang this up quickly. Um, she has her little booties, so we're gonna throw these on. And you know, is this outfit like a little bit tired? A little, like the midi skirt sweater booty thing. But I really do like the whole white vibe. And also this would be perfect to wear to work and then go straight to like a dinner date or if there's some kind of like, I don't know, like happy hour at work, like a little more of a dressy work outfit, you know? Um, very cute. So I think it's perfect. And then you could also easily just wear like a sweater that's a cardigan to take on and off since it is like not dead winter for a while. But where's my phone? I mean, I think this is a 10 out of 10. Like if you put them next to each other, they're pretty much the same thing. Probably wearing the exact same skirt. You know what I mean? So yeah, outfit two, check and killed it. Mm. Okay, so our next outfit might as well be sponsored by freaking Abercrombie. Um, use code Mallory15 for 10% off. No, I'm kidding. Um, so cute. I got these both last year at the sale before the end of winter. And I love them. I wish I could link them for you, but I'm sure they will have them out because I remember they were like selling out. So they fit so well. I love this outfit. But the outfit is so... I can't find my phone. So this girly pop looks like she's on her way to run errands, maybe take a flight. And I think this would be the most comfortable flight outfit because trousers are really comfortable. These have an elastic waistband in the back. The top is just a sweater top. And then she just casually has this lovely little sweater draped elegantly across. Just like, and this is a Lululemon sweater that I got so long ago. Um, she just has a kind of draped over and it's perfect because you can throw it on when you're in the plane and throw it over your shoulders when you're not um and then she has her big shades on these ones are from target i love these these are in stock so i will link these and then she just has air forces which we love an air force moment okay okay yeah like this is so easy and so cute i really like this outfit she also has like a little prada bag Okay, this little black bag like this. I mean, I'm literally hurt, right? This is the easiest little outfit I've ever seen in my life. So cute, right? Boom. Boom. I think this is a 10 out of 10 too. I think I really killed it. All right, outfit three, check. Okay, the whole reason I did this video is because of this outfit. I thrifted this little top. Look at how similar it is to this girl's. Are you kidding? These are the H&M jeans that were like $30 that I have not stopped wearing this summer. I mean, they're so cozy. They have held up so well. Boom. And then I don't have brown boots like this would be perfect with a brown boot, but I do have my shoots boots that are black, which I think are totally fine. I definitely would wear socks if I was real life wearing these. I mean, like, this is the coolest outfit I've ever had on. I think she would wear these, probably. So, my big sunnies. Um, and then she has a really fun bag. I don't have one, but this uh, top has a little blue in it. And I thrifted this purse, and it also has blue in it. So, we're going to go ahead and put that together. Slay, right? I mean, as soon as it hits 68 degrees, I'll be in this. You know? So cute for Saturday. Bopping and shopping. Boom. The thing is, like, I have all these cool, cool clothes, and I need to learn how to put them together in a very cool girl way. So we love a little inspo, and I think a button-up and jeans and boots are going to be a staple in my closet. It's just so fun. And obviously, like, so cozy. So, slay, 10 out of 10, 100 out of 1,000, killed it. 100 out of 1,000, that's bad. 1,000 out of 100, <laughs> yay, okay. I mean, I want to wear this right now. So this next one is just like a very easy like combination. A midi skirt or for instance, this is a squirt. But I have a couple of these. Like a midi skirt, a turtleneck, a boot. You know, just a very easy like styling outfit. But you can wear so many of them. Like, like a ton of different combinations. I would love this outfit. I could totally see myself wearing this out or for dinner dates or something maybe not to the office unless i had a tight on maybe um because it is a short but also who cares like my people my co-workers don't really i work in fashion so it's like not a big deal but super easy outfit 
I would maybe wear it with this brown bag because I have a brown top on. I think she's wearing navy and black, so I did brown and black because I don't have navy. But, I mean, overall, like, easy little combination outfit for the fall. Like, you can wear your, you know, roll your sleeves up. It's, like, warm on top, cooler on bottom, which I think is, like, the fall combination you need to have. A lot of times layers are helpful, but I think to slay, you could totally wear this. It's a thinner sweater, not too thick, not a cable knit. So, I would say this one is, like, an 8 out of 10 because it's not the same as what's in the photo, but it is the same vibe and super super easy super basic casual well not that casual but like maybe to me casual little outfit so yay that's it for this one all right so up next we have a girl in like some flare jeans i did my mom thrifted these jeans for me last year um they're super cute and they fit really well these are high-waisted which i think hers are not maybe they're a little bit maybe a mid-rise but these are like for sure a high waist. So I just paired it with like a little baby tee. This is my Abercrombie baby tee that I have three of because I'm obsessed with it. But you can find them pretty much anywhere. I just saw recently J. Crew has them now, H&M. They're at literally everywhere. So cute. And then she's wearing like just some chunky platform sandals. So I'm just going to throw these on from Target. The jeans are Banana Republic, by the way, thrifted. And then I have this vintage Abercrombie sweater that I thrifted. You can just love a thrift find, huh? This whole outfit almost. And she's just like in the rain, live laugh loving. So I usually just fold these in half and then wrap them around and then do a little tie action like so. Boom. And then what else does she got going on here? Oh, she has her own umbrella, which I will say you guys, I thought, should I do that? But then I remember, you know, when you grow up and they say like things that are bad luck and that's one of them. I don't know if I want to risk it. I'm just like not in the mood to have bad luck these days. I feel like I've done my fair share of bad luck recently. So we're going to not with that. <laughs> and then I have this bag that my mom thrifted. I really don't know why I still have it. I've never worn it. It's actually very heavy and there's nothing in it and it's so heavy, but it is kind of fun. Like, I wish it was just not this heavy. Um, boom. And that's it. Let's pretend my phone is an umbrella. Cheese. How did we do? We're staying like this. Cheese. Killed it. I think this is a 9 out of 10. I'm giving it a little bit less of a 9 because the jeans aren't perfect. But they're pretty damn near close. They're a little bit dark, I guess. Okay. So for this last look, I couldn't decide which cardigan to do. So I pulled this one. Thrifted. I believe Express. It's so cute has little pearlies this one a uh, sample sale very boxy very cool like it's one of my favorite cardigans i'll never get rid of this thing or what i first initially picked out was this one from h m which has that v look that she also has so i'm like hmm you know let's try this one on and then i just have on like this little tank this tank on that she has like this kind of so this button it up here like i think that does the trick really right i don't it just seems like a lot of neck um where's my phone where's my phone yeah i mean i think this one goes with what she has on best and then she kind of just tucked it in one side i don't know she hers is more frumpy or something i think i need to whatever this is close enough i'm starting to sweat what's new air conditioner off she's sweating then she has like a lot of jewelry on. So let's roll up the sleeves, make it like a little more stylized, throw on some gold necklaces. These two are from Express. I love Express jewelry as well as like Anthro jewelry. And then she has Birkenstocks on, which I did a poll and everyone said I needed them. And then I went to go buy them last night, one week later, because I wanted to, I've been doing this thing, like wait a week and then if you still want it, get it. And I have saved myself some serious cash doing that. But cute, this is actually really cute. The necklaces make it, but I don't have them. So I did, I have been looking for a pair of sandals. If you watched my vlog last week um, in LA, I went all over LA looking for sandals and I found some on sale on my way to work yesterday. So I'm gonna grab those. I think these are exactly what I was looking for and hopefully they are because they are final sale. I will say as a designer, seeing the colorations not matching perfectly, like if you can see here, this and this and this are all kind of different hues, um, which does bother me. But they were $35 from 100 and Birkenstocks are like 100 something. And these kind of do that same vibe, I think. And I do like the color and I think they'll be really comfortable. 
So anyway, got these. And this is the look, I guess. That went by quickly. I think this is like the perfect office outfit because I don't know about you, my office can be casual or dressy. This would be a good like Monday because it looks put together. You have the jewelry and everything, but you're still warm in this little sweater. And then you can layer by taking it off and you can always wrap it around your shoulder, but you're wearing like a nice jean. Oh, we're like, this would be a good Sunday dinner. I don't know. This is a very good, easy go-to outfit. And I'm loving this like 90s layering vibe. So I think we'll stick with the purple girly. And that, you guys, is it. That is the video. Anyway, that is a wrap on today's video. I actually love doing these, putting things together. It's not too hard. It reminds me of what I have in my closet, how you don't need to buy things new, how you can buy similar things. They don't have to be what Free People has online, what, you know, Revolve influencers are showing. You can really dig in, be creative, go thrifting, find things that are similar or invest in the things that you know you can wear several ways, which I've thought about maybe doing something where I pick like a few staple items and wear them bunch of different ways let me know if you're interested in more like outfit inspo videos because i love doing that kind of stuff or if you want me to do a thrift with me soon i definitely want to do fall trends fall outfit inspo so keep those in mind and if you're interested in those things subscribe like i would love to have you as a subscriber i um love hearing from you guys so comment your favorite outfits what you've been doing i don't know what you've been doing this week what's up <laughs> make sure to check me out on tiktok and instagram as well i post all the time and i love doing polls on instagram so make sure to check those out for any opinions i really get an idea of what people are wanting spooky um and thank you guys so much i guess it's a cloudy day and thank you guys so much for watching and i will see you guys in my next video next week which is gonna be thursday and yay okay bye